Diversity are all the characteristics that make each of us unique. There are characteristics that are visible to the eye, and then there are those characteristics that are not. And then equal opportunity for persons from all backgrounds to develop their skills, interests, and desires. And inclusion is the idea that we're all welcome, and the greater our diversity, the greater our strength. Oftentimes people think of diversity, equity, and inclusion as everybody gets the same thing. Um, and to me, it's not everybody gets the same thing, it's everybody gets what they need to be successful. As a young university, relatively speaking, we've seen a ton of growth happen in a short amount of time, and I think that that's also really inspiring to the future because I think that shows us that we have the ability to grow even more um, and to listen to our students even more to say, okay, are we missing somebody? Who are we not helping? How can we do better? People with disabilities are people too. And that when I hear diversity, equity, and inclusion, that means everyone. Curriculum should be a window into how other people experience the world. Um, and curriculum should also be a mirror so that students see themselves reflected in the curriculum. And you can't do it all with every day or every lesson. But throughout the course, throughout the course of the term, um, students should see themselves reflected in. So LGBT folks should, should see how they are integrated in the community and what impact they've had. Well, I think students who take my classes are exposed to a wide variety of issues in that I try to not only talk about what's happened in the past, but how that relates to some things that are going on now. Now that I've experienced a lot of the world, I've came back to Michigan with a lot more of an understanding and the transition from military to civilian has been easier too, being around other people who are accepting and understanding of the other cultures. Diversity means something to us. We know that if we're going to send our students out into the workplace, out into the world, to the larger global community, they need to be able to work with people that are different than them. We now see diversity as an absolute necessity to ensuring a quality education for all of the students uh, that attend here and a way to grow and develop everyone. A lot of what multicultural organizations do is try to create experiences for people. So I, you've, it's kind of like saying, hey, we are not in Africa or South America or Europe, but we can bring little tastes, little pieces of that culture to Oakland University. A lot of our students are coming to Oakland with a really unique opportunity because they have this chance then to interact with people who are different than them. It's important that Oakland University is diverse because we're in such a diverse area. We grow through learning about different perspectives and having our own ideas challenged. We're all here for, for one big reason, and that's to help students succeed. And so if we can stop and think about diversity as a bigger issue to say, all of our students are coming with backgrounds from different places. What can we do to help them get better? I think that's going to do best for all of us. Students can be as strong leaders as faculty and administration. Uh, it's not just the talk uh, that's necessary. It's students stepping up and saying, we want action to happen. It's students stepping out and creating proposals. If there's no cry for change, then there won't be any change. We have to learn to use our voices to stand up, not just for our own rights, but to stand for others and to stand with others.